What's going on, Scorpio gang, gang, gang? Hope all is well with you guys. To my Scorpio kisses. Mm -hmm. Throw them gang signs in the chat. We go together real, real bad. I fuck with y'all the long way. Y'all know that shit. I love you guys so, so much. I'm sending y'all the love and light your heart can hold and ever even imagine. Scorpio, you so powerful. I wish you just would own that shit. Like, literally, I've been owning that shit in my life. Like, own it. That's who you are. That's your inheritance. Like, literally. God is saying, why you don't believe what everybody else already know? This ain't even no hidden shit. This is why people keep coming back. This is why people keep being clingy. This is why people in your energy, but they ain't helping you none. Who am I talking to? They just love the fruit of it, the nurturing, the, the sap on the tree, the honey, the like, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's that type of energy. Man, then you got folks who just like, Scorpio, <laughs> so it's just said you've been a target all your life. Literally, you've been a target. All, that's your journey. Who am I talking to? God said he thought you'd have gave up by now and gave in and surrendered to it, but you keep fighting against it. You're a target. You'll never be somewhere, Scorpio, just... Mm, you doing a... Because mm, you'll never be somewhere where you can be centered. Who am I talking to? God said you a warrior. You not a Reiki healer. Who am I talking to? Your words are not meant to soothe the soul. Your words were meant to cut it in half. To make it bleed out on you. So you'll remember who the hell you are. Who am I talking to? You know, I, I, I'm hearing something very significant here about a wellness check. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, Okay. You looking at Scorpio every fucking day. You following Scorpio. You taking footage. You recording shit. You worse than the paparazzi. Scorpio ain't even famous. Let them tell it. I guess you infamous, Scorpio. That's the problem. You 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 telling the police <laughs> you live somewhere. Your jealous ass live somewhere out of the state. So I know you watching me every fucking day on YouTube. Or Facebook. But you going to send the police to my house to do a wellness check? Oh, somebody, 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 whoever this hoe is, they sending the police or something to your house. Either one or two things. They hoping you got some illegal activity going on. Let me tell y'all something for y'all bitches that's low vibration like that. Scorpio ain't been this clean in they whole fucking life, bitch. I'm sitting here chewing on celery. Listen to me real good. Celery, I'm eating wheat bread and I'm working out five times a week. Girl, I don't have time to do no, no crimes. So whoever trying to send the police to your house because it used to be jumping like that or whatever the fuck you got going on, ho, they're not going to find anything. But for some of you Scorpios, they sending somebody to do a wellness check because you supposed to be checkmate and you're not. Somebody done sent them some, 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 some false pictures of some fucking body. Telling them that it's a done dollar. Somebody, in other words, y'all, that, that all that money y'all got together and scraped up and all the witchcraft y'all got together and scraped up in y'all kitchen to do for Scorpio, the shit didn't fucking work. You got played, bitch. And who are you going to call, bitch? Ghostbusters? Because you can't call the police that you sent to do a wellness check on me. Scorpio to see if we okay, bitch. Yes, I'm fine. The creator got me. Stop worrying about me. You, you, you ain't worrying about in my well. You worrying about in my it as the target man took it out. There's no fucking such thing. Stop sending your energy towards Scorpio. It's not gonna work. I'm also hearing something about like eight. They keep I keep okay. I keep hearing 18 years. Something very significant about 18 years. Something very significant about 18 years and inheritance. Somebody should have somebody should have gotten an inheritance when they were 18. 
But somebody had a baby before you turned 18, so it like turned back the clock of the inheritance. I don't know why they're telling me that. I don't even know if that's a thing. But it's like the person turning 18, the baby turns 18, and they get their inheritance. But if another baby is born between the time that the the child this child turns 18 the baby turns 18 then it starts all over again so I, I i don't know if that could be significant for somebody who understand like inheritances like that that sound like a lot of wealth that sound like a long line of money wealth right there cuz i ain't never even heard of no shit like that like it start over if a baby born i'm also here like that's why they kept you knocked up Cause they didn't want this karmic ex-wife and their child to get their inheritance. That's every time they knocked you up, it turned back the 18 years. I'm also hearing too, that's why they're 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 um they trying to take you out. <laughs> you and your child or something like that, your firstborn, I don't know, your baby child, whatever this is, they're trying to checkmate you. And on top of that, they're letting you know that you're not in hiding. They see you now or some shit like that. But really what they don't know is confirmation for them. It's checkmate for them. This, this energy right here giving me the equivalent of two people being in the streets and they won, but then one person going to shoot up this person's mama house. <laughs> it, it, it's not going to be a wellness check needed. Anybody passing by this bitch going to tell everybody in the house dead. If if somebody, if, if his mama not dead and whoever else, if she keep the grandbabies, whatever, I'm hearing this. They showing me this. Because whoever this is, they doing a wellness check to see if you still alive, Scorpio, to see that they get the target. The thing about you being a target is you God's target. Meaning you go wherever he send you target. Not they motherfucking target. You're guaranteed to miss. Every time you shoot at Scorpio, you're, you're going to miss. Even the ancient ones I just heard. They don't miss, but they miss when they hit Scorpio. Who am I talking to? They keep seeing you singular, but they don't know you stand with thousands. Maya Angelo, I stand as one. <laughs> but it's 10,000 here. Like I ain't by myself, literally. You think you outnumbering Scorpio, you sending the, the police to catch Scorpio. I knew they was coming. <laughs> Who am I talking to, high priestess? She said, I knew they was coming. I had my best incense burning. Who am I talking to? Salt in my corners. Okay, the devil. The police, the devil right now. Who? The police. I ain't even worried about what you trying to checkmate or whatever the fuck you trying to do. I ain't even looking at no confirmation. All I know is that lady, that master lady, she said, I rebuke you in the name of the of Jesus. And he shot her in the head. So I'm more concerned with that at this point. I ain't even concerned with y'all weak motherfuckers. Who am I talking to? They don't know you stay on red alert. That's what you was created to do. Stay on red alert. Oh, they translate that as you a spiritual bully because you ain't letting nobody fuck over you. And it might be one or two, you know, that don't make it through the loop. You might be one or two that maybe you were genuine. But the 12 I got rid of, if you two was the only thing that was on the other side of it, to God be the glory. And that's literally what I'm getting. Let's get into this message. Somebody kept you knocked up. Somebody could have six kids, eight kids. <laughs> Like, they ain't want this other person to get the money, but I'm hearing that money belong to you. Like, a lot of people are going to be... I feel like they're going to start getting some type of messages about inheritances. It's like you the last man standing oh so fucking big. Y'all don't understand the mountains my daddy moved for me. If it means everybody got to go, somebody done kept you pregnant to keep this inheritance, okay, it might not have been for my kids. But my kids' kids going to get it. God is saying enough is enough with that bullshit. Ain't no wellness check for Scorpio. 
The death, the rebirth. You checking on me. No, you ain't checking on me. You checking on you. That's what you're doing. That's confirmation for you. That's checkmate for real for you. That's God saying, oh yeah, this bitch is unsal unsalgeable. Like this bitch will do anything. I can't trust them with money. I can't trust them with gifts. Checkmate. Yeah, they said they see me. No, you don't see me. God see you. He see you all the time. What's the message? Who the fuck is this in your energy, Scorpio? Like, it's checkmate. Yeah, look. Kicked out. No motivation. This somebody who real, real mad. This somebody who real mad because all of a sudden, it's that energy. I told you, Scorpio made love to your ass last night and this morning. I gotta go. <laughs> You 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 too. You don't have any motivation. I see myself staying here with you and going under. I'm not I'm not willing to sacrifice who I am for you, so you can be comfortable or so you can have my life like a shit show like yours. It's not gonna happen. I don't know whoever this is. They mad because somebody somebody was smart enough <laughs> to keep you pregnant and keep this inheritance from their child, like literally. Whoever this hoe is, she's an old asshole too. They targeting your kids. But your kids are target of God's too. Like they can't that God know that's God know that's your whole heart. Even if they don't like you, I just heard. That's what I just heard. It says they shamed you with a STD. Yeah, wellness check my ass, bitch. For some of y'all, y'all could, the health department could be literally knocking on your door, Scorpio, telling you somebody to name you as some type of STD. You good, though. You used a condom. They could have named you, and I'm on my way down to a free test. I pay for these every six months. Let's go. Clean as a fucking whistle. Why? You kick that bitch out. Like, this bitch, whoever this is, though, who I got to go down here for, you're done. I'm, I'm just, like... Somebody, somebody checking on Scorpio, the wellness check. I see you. I'm seeing I see you. Somebody, somebody could be in I see you because they trusted this bitch. Scorpio is coming back. Whoever you are, if they in a coma, whatever going on with Scorpio, bitch, they're getting downloads on what they need at this time, proper rest. They're, they're fully protected. And your ass out here, your life is in shambles right now because you know this shit is coming on to you. It says, sis, I see him being nice and affectionate to other people, but not to you. I have a problem with that, period. Yeah, that's who this bitch is. He out there pouring cups every single where, but he telling you who you should be and who you should not be and all this bullshit. Yeah, now they having health problems. They in the ICU. I'm telling you, somebody in the ICU. If it's Scorpio, you coming out. If it ain't Scorpio, you in the ICU, bitch. Like, just period. And the wellness check joke is on you now. You get wellness check every what? Top of the hour. Let's hope your ass don't go in, in the bottom half or in the middle of that hour. Because that's where Scorpio at with your ass. Somebody wanted you dead, Scorpio. You 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 was somebody target, bro. They didn't know God <laughs> said you was his target. He's, he's always paying attention to what's going on with you, Scorpio. He's very concerned with who he loves. Who spend time with him. Who trusts him with self, they couldn't trust no other ways. He heal us because we come to him and we dump it on the person that can really take it and save it and do whatever he want to do with it and say you're forgiven. Who am I talking to? Somebody try to make you believe some bullshit. They sending the police to check you out to see if you okay. Yeah, they heard you had a new man or a new woman. This could be a new man or a new woman in your life. Take it how this take your shit how it resonates. It says, here we go, child spine. Yeah, somebody looking in, somebody spying with they looking ass and still can't see shit. <clears throat> I'm telling you, somebody, somebody is somebody was kept from a lot of money. Because of this new person. And you could have been the new person. Take this wherever you want to, Scorpio. Wherever you at. I just know you heavily protected. And if this is somebody new in your life. <clears throat> they targeted you. They, they were already spying. They were already. Or they had scouts about. People looking you up. Or you know what I'm saying. Around the clock. Keeping tabs. This, this is somebody new source just said. 
This could be somebody, somebody sent to enter your life just to like, you know, kind of like get in there and know what the fuck going on. Because I feel like you're a closed book. On the bottom of the deck, you got ancestors in the reverse here. Yeah, I feel like this is one of those energies that you can take care of. Like you, you should be fully aware, Scorpio, of what's going on. And I feel like you are because your first energy is like... First of all, I, you don't even know about this other shit that somebody knock on your door. But what this card is telling me, you know, your first card is like, you kick this person out just because he ain't got no motivation. Like, he ain't matching your fucking energy. And we arguing. Not only, no, it, it's, yeah, he's not matching your energy. But the biggest part about why you kicking this bitch out is because now I'm matching his energy. His low vibrational ass. Now I'm upset. Now I'm arguing with this person. Like, what am I arguing with you for when I know you here to, like, get something for free? Is the energy I'm getting with this. Let's get into the tarot here. Clarify kicked out no motivation. But I feel like what's going to happen is whoever this new person is, or this could be the new person. Take it out, resonate. It's just they do too much. They got a lot of shit going on. They even got a, another person going on. But somebody is new in somebody's life. So let's get into it here. What's the kicked out no motivation? I feel like with the spine, spine card, this person targeted you. Because I keep getting something very significant about targeting and 18 years. You couldn't even be 18 years old. Your judgment. Yeah, I feel like with this person, you just called it. You just like, this per we, we you know... Like I said, for some of y'all, it's the fact that this person don't just don't just don't meet your vibe. And for some of y'all, it's the fact that you got to come down. Like your energy being disrupted every day because you decided to allow this person in your life type energy. It's like, uh, no, nah, I'm good. You calling judgment on this shit. And this person looking at you like no motivation. I'm like the most no motivated person you know. Actually, you're not. Actually, I'm the most motivating person you know because I've been trying to motivate you and yet you still have no motivation. So, <laughs> you know, it's just not, it's a no for Scorpio. Like not meeting your vibration and then bitch, you want to be low key like jealous of me and envious and sending the police to my house thinking I'm going to be maybe smoking a little weed or something, drinking some wine. No, I'm not. I'm just hearing like Scorpio, you never been at your best. People don't even know. You ain't got to have a bank full of money. You at your best still. You're the cleanest you ever been. You the most relaxed you ever been. Yeah, you ain't where you want to be, but guess what? You found how to find solace in solitude and not be lonely. You know you're not alone. Yeah, look, the two of cups. I can't make this shit up. I feel like a divine union is coming in, a partnership, a friendship, a marriage. Like all those boxes to check with this person. Like just perfect harmony. As opposed to this other person you kicking out or you, you know, leaving behind. It's like our vibration just, it, it can't, you can't even catch up. It feel like this person is so immature to even be having a conversation of breaking down what I'm saying is almost an insult to Scorpio's, you know, journey. Like, literally. <laughs> and Scorpio, I feel like you're going to find yourself in a lot of situations now like, what the fuck am I doing here? Like, I could be doing so much other shit with 12 years, 12 hours in my day than being with somebody gossiping about, gossiping about me. I'm feeling negative energy. I'm being forced to, like, be in a place where nobody wants me and I'm a blessing. Do y'all know how hard that is? Do you know how draining that is just to pay your rent? So a lot of you Scorpios are calling just judgment on every situation, like, People in your life that's not helping you, that's got you strained and, you know, spread thin. You're getting rid of them. you like, if I'm already spread thin, if I get rid of you, I, I, got, I got sense enough to know one third of that coming back instantly. So it's like in jobs where, you know, you may have picked a job that pay more, but the only reason they pay more because you're doing four more hours a day. You may decide to go back to your old job where you work less hours and you have more peace. It's like you just call in judgment on just like sacred union. Like with a job, with a person, with my daughters. With, like if it ain't that, I don't want it. I don't want to be a part of it. If I'm not motivating you to be better, I need you out my life. I feel like that's the energy. You kicking motherfuckers out your life. You call in judgment. You want compatibility. You want balance. You want love. 
You want soulmate energy, just period. If it ain't that, get the fuck off my couch. If you on my couch, this is definitely not soulmate energy. Because soulmate energy, you want it in you, around you, like, all the time. It's just what it is. It's intoxicating. Yeah, what I said, the eight of wands. You want it around all the time. I feel like this shit just happening quick to people. But for Scorpio, it's like, it, it, it's really been a long time coming. You just thinking on your shit that I've been with you. Your relationship, our relationship, man, I've been through way more. Like, I've had way more assignments than you. God know exactly what you need, Scorpio, and I feel like he getting that to you. Clarify they um shamed you with an STD. Who the fuck is this? Coward low down dog. Yeah, the Knight of Cups. I told you, this somebody who, you know, they come in. They come in like a lamb and leave like a wolf. I'm telling you, they 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 wolves and sheep clothe them in. They come in all romantic and powered up and they do all this shit to get you and then they can't maintain what they did because it was all a lie. Yeah, look, the four swords. I just feel like you you tired of the bullshit and you call it judgment on it. You That four swords is just what I talked about, the solitude. You're realizing sometimes being by yourself, being alone don't mean you lonely. Sometimes you need that. I feel like for some of y'all Scorpios, Y'all calling these, y'all calling these shots now because you just like stress the fuck out and you don't like how you feel it. You don't like how you, you know, this type of energy is just going to push opportunity away from you, not draw it to you. So it's like you clean the house. Scorpio get like that to pay the swords. It's like I'm ready to try some new shit. This shit ain't working. And I feel like the whole thing about everything beyond this kicked out card, it's like this who this person is. Really? But it's like you it's almost like you see this shit before it happened. This is like a premonition or something. It's like you kick this bitch out before you even know anything about an STD or any of this shit. They targeted you and you spiritually targeted their ass. So when this whoever this health official knock on your door, yeah, you've been named in an STD, da da da. We need you to come down. Okay, cool. You test for boom, 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 boom. So it's like for Scorpio, it's like, yeah, I'm going down here to get me a free checkup. It, that's how God blessing you. Like every everywhere you turn, you being blessed like that too. Now, now this dumb fuck that I got on my couch that was sleeping around on me, showing everybody else affectionate, everybody else seeing this shit because they in the streets with this. So I'm home with damn rollers in my head, getting ready for work with my face cream on and had me a couple of glasses of wine. You out here, you know what I'm saying? Since he out here like. Like you single and got money, bitch, please. And you out here having sex? Unprotected sex? Okay. And you want to see if I'm well. I'm going to get me a wellness check. And I'm going to let you know I am well. Whoever checking on Scorpio to see if they're well, if they're still in the living, you know that. You know that. Clarify since I see him being nice and affectionate to everybody else. Yeah, see the nine of cups in reverse. This bitch pouring cups. This person very happy when he round the whole shit. The Jezebel energy. Yeah, the seven of wands. When he's abbreviated. How do they call it? An abbreviated? Drunk, falling over. People picking his pockets and shit like that. He kissing on motherfuckers. He done forgot he married just because he had a few drinks. Okay. For a lot of people, it takes way more than that. And then they go that Wheel of Fortune. This is your friend or somebody. This could even be your own consciousness. Just telling you, you you worth more. The Seven of Pentacles came out in the reverse. You ain't fucking with it no more, Scorpio. You just cut his ass off. And that's what they mad at. They look at it like y'all, you know, you, you've been a part of this plan. You've been falling for this shit. Why all of a sudden now? Because the Wheel of Fortune been here, bitch. The Wheel of Fortune is inside me. I dumb it down so that you can feel like you were somebody. But see what happened? They put you in this Nine of Cups in reverse, Seven of Wands energy. Where you were, you know, feeling defenses, let, defenseless, letting them control you. You could have even picked up habits, drinking, doing drugs, smoking more, whatever. Getting away from what you really need to be focused on. Because of this person <laughs> that you thought loved you. You know, the Knight of Cups, you come in and do whatever to get me, but you can't maintain that same energy, that same vibe. And it's suspect with Scorpio. It's, like, it's a no-go. And then here come the Wheel of Fortune. Because why? The, the will of fortune is inside of Scorpio. That dial is subject to turn at any time. The seven of swords is in reverse. 
Yeah, this person being exposed for whatever this is they, they thought they was doing. You know, whether it be sleeping around and trying to control you, make you feel like you losing your mind, telling them, you know, to get out. Like this person, I, like you putting them out because right now they, they, they falling low. Bitch, you been low. For some of us Scorpios, I swear to God, we be done stay with these low life, low vibrational motherfuckers so long till they feel like we owe them when we get to the point of saying that they're low, when we actually physically say it out their mouth, when we say, you know what, you ain't doing shit. All this help I gave you and you still ain't no better. Like, they look at you like, this is the first time. See what I'm saying? <laughs> Clarify new man, new woman. And I just feel like you ain't, you ain't trying to even, because motherfuckers just don't, they ain't really smart as they think they are. And I just feel like with, with, with your energy now, Scorpio, you just not confrontating with nobody about you. Yeah, you getting wellness checks. Some, some people just checking on you because they ain't seeing you on the scene. Ain't shit, I am, I am the wellness check. The Ten of Cups, I chose happiness. I chose to make my own family. Yeah, the two of pentacles. Balance. You decided if you was going to juggle something, you juggle it yourself in your life, the ace of cups. I feel like this self-love, I feel like this is self-awareness. I feel like, Scorpio, you just realize, like, it ain't nobody's job to make you happy. And this ten of cups, the two of pentacles, and this ace of cups, is clarifying the spine. This is why they targeted you. They know you had a big heart. They know you was a nurturer. They knew you was somebody who, you know, if they had you in their corner, you know, they'd be all right. Yeah, look, the queen of clubs. They know you was a, a, a nurturer, Scorpio. You were a target, Justice here, though. They didn't know what kind of target you were. They didn't know you was God's target. Give me one more on this um, new man here. Yeah, the devil. <laughs> new man, new woman. I'm telling you, that's what make this person start spying and targeting you and being obsessive with you. Because they, th they thinking, now now this give this person a reason to say why you kicked them out, Scorpio. Because you telling them, bitch, I'm kicking you out because you a deadbeat. I done took care of your ass too long or, you know, you still complaining about your bills three years later. You ain't did shit to correct it or, like, make your income a little better. You ain't did shit but depend on me. And I'm just cutting the ropes. Like, literally. So, it's like, now that you got a new man or woman, here he come back obsessing about you now, trying to, you know, draw this narrative to everybody. I told y'all she was cheating on me. This bitch done, done cheated on you 99 times. Sometime with a nigga. Okay, that's what I just heard. Because I keep getting down low in these readings. I just don't say it. Every time I see them spy, spying or hiding behind something and they say, here we go, child, I be like, that's a gay dude. He watching and smile like this person glad you put them out because now they going over there. That's just what I'm getting. They the devil. They're tempted by all kind of sexual prowess things like they like this person probably sexually awkward too. And if somebody's sexually awkward, the Scorpio, you truly sexually fucking awkward. So any Scorpio can respect 2828 on my timer. Any Scorpio coming from another Scorpio can respect when I say this person's when I say they sexually awkward, you know what the fuck that means. All kind of flags gonna go off. They ain't got to be red, they could be any fucking color. They just going off everywhere. And I feel like this person very obsessed with you having sex with other people. They like to watch you have sex. With other people. I'm seeing that too with the spine. This person could be like peeping Tom. Yeah, this person is 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 a, a heavy on masturbating to like your videos and your pictures. And it's it's almost like I feel the energy like this this is what's fueling this person because they can't they can't come in contact with you at all. Like there's no way for them to contact you. I feel like you're protecting your ancestors are in the reverse because I feel like this is something you can handle. What's the um advice for Scorpio? Yeah, the ten of wands in reverse. This is something you can handle. <laughs> your, your, your ancestors chilling. They're like, nah, she can handle that ten of wands in reverse. Yeah, the high priestess. Like, I feel like you got some type of upgrade spiritually. Yeah, the page of pentacles in reverse. It's like you, they no longer feeding you spiritual Baby food. You on table food now with the page of pentacles in reverse. 
It's like no more practicalities, no more being, you know, no more having prospects. Everything is like set in stone for me with the page of pentacles in reverse. It's like no, no more small offers. No more playing it safe. Like you don't have to, like, you know what you're doing. Give me one more here for Scorpio. Yeah, the nine of pentacles. I feel like you said you're, you're, you're in the energy of Scorpio being free and abundant. And you realize how to maintain that. Yeah, the King of Cups is your overall energy. I feel like you meet somebody that's very emotionally mature because I feel like that's what you need right now, a balance between you being able to stay your high vibrational self and still be able to take your emotions out of certain decisions that you make just to be able to navigate, Scorpio. Very significant. They're telling me about what you think at this time and what you speak. I've been saying it for weeks. Anything you give power to, Scorpio, is going to manifest like very quickly in your 3D. So be very cautious, cautious of what you say about other people as well, okay? Because, you know, you don't want that judgment or that karma on you. All right, Scorpio, I love you guys so, so much. I'll see you in the next video.